Welcome to How to Cook That. I'm Anne Reardon, and today we're going to make rock candy with the large sugar crystals, not the little normal sized crystals of sugar, but the chunky looking crystals. To do that, you need to firstly fill a thermos with hot water and then set that to one side. Then place your food colouring, sugar, water and if you like some flavouring into a saucepan. For the quantities that you need just click on the link in the description below this video to go to the blog howtocookthat.net. Heat those up until it just starts to boil and you can't see any little crystals of sugar in there anymore. So lift some up on your spoon, let the bubbles disperse and check that it's totally clear. Once you get to that point tip the hot water out of your thermos and tip your sugar solution in straight away. Take a couple of lollipop sticks and I like to make some little indents on them using scissors just to give the sugar crystals something to hang on to. Tie some string onto those and tie them up so they'll hang just above where you're going to put your thermos. Put some aluminium foil over the top of your thermos and poke those lollipop sticks in through the aluminium foil into your hot sugar solution. Now the secret to forming the large crystals instead of the small ones is to let that solution cool down really slowly and it's best not to disturb it at all. I'll lift it up to show it to you here after a day you have a really light layer of sugar over your stick. After a couple of days you're starting to get some crystals and then you, if you leave it for about four or five days you start to get some more crystals and the crystals are growing larger on there. Don't forget to leave your requests in the comment section below and thank you to everyone who has subscribed. I'll see you next week. Bye.